Hello and welcome to Prudent Media News. First, a look at the headlines. Government won't postpone panchayat polls, says Panchayat Minister Parsekar. Goa will at tense as Sarpanch denies OBC certificates to aspirants. Pilan citizens petition director panchayat. Crime branch tracking major visa racket, arrest two notorious criminals from Mumbai. Team from crime branch leaves for Mumbai to honor further links of racket. Government to reconsider MOI issue and grants. Education director tells High Court. Directorate to issue fresh circular to substitute original controversial circular of June 2011 on medium of instruction. Question marks on Suka and Chidi's future, but Salonga Sports Club will not play inflated salaries, says coach Karim Bancharifa. And Goan rhythms resonate in Bangalore. Percussionist Carlos Gonzalez gives energy to Royal Challengers Bangalore. Now the news in detail. Panchayat Minister Lakshminga Parsikar has made it clear that panchayat election cannot be postponed at this stage and government will not postpone the polls. Election Commission had earlier on Wednesday said that power to postpone polls vest with the government. Goa Velia witnessed tension on Thursday as local Sarpanch denied OBC certificates to some people. Meanwhile, Pilan Citizens Forum met the director of panchayat and raised issue of delimitation and reservation of boards. The लोग मागता भाई ये इलेक्शन पुढे दुकला आणि तुम करेक्शन कराते की पुढे दुकलपाक जाता तुमका ना 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 शक्यता हे असा नाही घटनात्मक पेज निर्माण झालो तो आमचा करबा जाना पिलेन सिटिझन्स फोरम अँड सोसायटी मेंबर्स आर क्राइंग फॉल ओव्हर द डिलिमिटेशन ऑफ वॉर्ड्स इन मेनी विलेजेस डायरेक्टर ऑफ पंचायत सेज ही विल पुट अप अ नोट टू द गव्हर्नमेंट इन दिस रिगार्ड तो म्हणतो की जनना रिझर्वेशन करता इलेक्टर रोल घेन को आखे पॉप्युलेशन घेन को आता तो पॉप्युलेशन वो भाले आसते घाटी भरले आसते को घाटी थे मैग्रंट आसते हाँ जे को नॉन गुवंस आसते हाँ तो घूम पॉप्युलेशन कर सारे ना पैले सद्या सेंसस सारे ना दुसरे सद्या टाइम सारको घूंक ना तीसरे सद्या मैपा गए ती सी सारी ना सो तो सारे गाँव से कि परिस्थिति सारी फिजिकल रियलिटी सारे ना जॉग्राफिकल एक्सप्लेन टू दम दीगल impediment how it can be done and how it cannot be done so they have told me at least you put up the report to the government which i have assured them i will be putting up and then they have also suggested certain reforms certain uh, remedies to be done that also i will be people from south andre panchayat expressed anger as sarpanch of goa valley panchayat denied obc certificates to some people finally i is the 2145 on jere lo ani थोड़ा इश्यू के लिए तेने सर्टिफिकेट आ थोड़े रिमार्क मारे तुम्हें आर डी रिटर्न फॉर्म हाड़ी सैलरी सर्टिफिकेट हाड़ी आनी बैंक बैलेंस दिवस सो जे मनीस काम करिना आते को बैंक बैलेंस जा सैलरी सर्टिफिकेट आर डी रिटर्न खुंचे आसते ये ते अ क्या कि टाइम पीरियड जान जाओ इलेक्शन कॉन्टेस्ट जाऊचे ना सुकोर रेश मागोश एंड उगा पंचायत हाड अप्रोच दी हाईकोर्ट ऑन द इश्यू ऑफ डिलिमिटेशन while chikli panchayat had raised issue of electoral rolls sukur and uzga panchayat withdrew the petitions on thursday meanwhile dataram nayak a contestant has raised objection on delimitation of wards in davoli dikarpale village panchayat a reporter from panji navdeep ager with video journalist omkar phalari crime branch all set to crack the biggest visa racket in the country Crime branch officials have taken two notorious criminals into custody following investigation in the visa racket case in Margaon. They are currently in police custody. A team of crime branch officials have left for Mumbai to investigate into the case. A youth had complained to the Margaon police that he was duped by an agency assuring him job in Australia and New Zealand. Names of four suspects were mentioned in the complaint. 
Following the complaint, crime branch started its investigation. The youth had claimed that he was duped of 3 lakh rupees. The suspects are alleged of looting about 23 people for 92 lakh rupees. Links of this racket have been found in Mumbai. Mohammad Shah Bandari from West Santa Cruz and Abdul Rauf Alikar of Raigad of Mumbai is said to be mastermind behind the racket. These are the visuals of Abdul Rauf Alikar in the crime branch custody. These people have cheated many more innocent people in Goa and nearby states. Earlier, anti-terrorist squad had arrested the duo in different other cases. On 20th April, these two criminals were taken into custody by the Goa police. Presently, they are remanded to seven days police custody. A team of Goa crime branch has moved to Mumbai to unearth for the links into the case. Their links with other states, case registered with the ATS in Mumbai, their business in Goa and more will be revealed after thorough investigation by the crime branch officials. Sources say this can turn out to be a major visa racket. A reporter in Panji Lokik Shilkar with video journalist Omkar Falari. The state government will reconsider the medium of instruction issue and the grants. The Director of Education informed this decision of the Goa Bench of Bombay High Court on Thursday. The Education Directorate will also issue a fresh circular to substitute the original controversial circular dated 10 June 2011. Educationist Dr. Pandurang Narkarni and some parents had filed a petition before the High Court challenging the decision-making process of the government on medium of instruction and grounds to the English medium primary schools. After a detailed hearing, the High Court had kept the judgment on the petition reserved. The matter came up before the bench of Justice Avinash Lavande and Justice Utkarsh Bakre on Thursday. The government is now reconsidering its decision and policy on the medium of instruction. Director of Education Anil Pawar filed this affidavit before the court on Wednesday. The next hearing will be held on Monday. Director of Education says, Government has decided to reconsider entire MOI issue and grants. Government will consider suggestion from all sections of society. Government will consider provisions of Right to Education Act 2009. Circular dated 10th June 2011 shall be substituted with fresh circular. Government will protect interest of all sections of society and government will take appropriate decision. The petitioner's advocate has sought a time from the court till next week to reply the respondent government's affidavit. The High Court will then decide on the disposal of the petition if the petitioners are satisfied with the government's reply vis-a-vis -vis the grievances and the issues raised by them. The judgment on this petition is currently reserved. A reporter, Navdi Pagiar for Prudent Media. It's time for a short break. Stay tuned. 